Hello everybody, this is Baron the Bear. It's going to be another video for the mobile game Call of Dragons. This is going to be a first impression video for uh, pre-launch. Uh, I already made the documented video that's like almost 30 minutes for myself for personal use. I document everything. I have a process of how I do this, how I do my content. I don't rush into the game because I find if I take my time initially I can actually pick up on what new players will struggle in the game so I do have my own process and I'm sharing this video just to kind of show other content creators maybe some ideas on how to do content for new games when they first get into them also to give players a heads up first thing I always do I'll try to keep this under 10 minutes if I can 15 no more if you fall asleep, you know, I'm warning you right now. Okay, first thing I always do is I check the map. I got this already documented how I, what my views are on this. It, it's an A plus in my opinion. Um, there are some issues I see. There's no option to view the big map region. The mini map is a little too small in my opinion. It does move really good. You can navigate everything, but I wish it was maybe settings in the general profile settings you could adjust to make that bigger I'm sure they'll put that in the feature uh, all this right here all these things here great buttons here you know if you love to push them that's great uh, up top left it hides everything that's perfect um, that's pretty much everything I do with the map I'll go back to the base and the next thing I always look at in these games, I check a lot of these games out. I have to have a routine, you know, so um, it's going to be the altar. I'm going to go here, see the, what the gotcha system's like. I like the butterfly kind of design, too. I like the art department a lot. I watch one of their videos. There's Simon, the art director. I don't think that's his, that's his real name, but I think they're going for, for simplicity purposes, maybe. But I like Simon a lot. I, on that video, I recommend it. That's their newest video they put up. Watch that video. Give them some love. Like their video. Comment. Uh, I really have good impressions about the development team in this game. They're, I think they're amazing people. Uh, I haven't even really got into the game, and I already can, I can pick up on that. <laughs> urgent message the tomorrow's video titled call of dragons maybe i am crazy will be linked in my video description in this video important feedback wanted i just wanted to throw this out there try to keep this short i'm going to show you where you can check and get those links real quick before i go on with the rest of the video no video i use for my illustration purposes only uh once again, underneath the demo video here, got 35 views four days ago. Call of Dragons, right to the right of Call of Dragons is the more option. You click that, and you're going to see all the links over here on the side. Uh, my content creator link, uh, click on that. I got my clan invite link. Uh, check that out. Uh, but all of my uh, videos will be posted. I will have the, the video for tomorrow will be posted on the very top of that of those links. So make sure you check that out. All right. Thanks, guys. Hit draw. Just going to see this at the basic, you know, see what it is. Nice setup. It's going to get you to want to spend. That's always good for a game to get some healthy spending to get more content. Uh, another thing on a silver chest, I went over this in my last video, but uh, just look at the chances. That's always good, the best advice I can give you. Always look at the chances. Never spend any money on keys until you know what the chances are. That's my advice. Guaranteed epic or legendary area every 10 draws, so they're definitely a little generous. You know, if you get a 10 key pack, if you sell that. What else do I got here? We got the scout thing here. It's not too bad. It was a little buggy, I noticed, but maybe that was just my tablet. Could be just my tablet. Uh, the settings are really turned down. Okay, there we go. It took a little second, but yeah, the graphics don't, don't, it looks pretty bad, but it's just because I'm on a tablet. So don't panic, guys, if you're just trying to check this out and see what, what's in here. Uh, this is, you know, if you're on a, they have this for computer, which is kind of nice. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I'm not going to do that. Okay. Packs. Oh, I got the, got the events. Always check out the events. Looks nice. I love the, I love the artwork. I tell you. Hats off. I mean, I thought my last game I was playing was good, but geez, Pete, this is even better. Okay. We got this beautiful artwork and the animations. It's just, yeah, it just makes you want to just do all this stuff. It's nice and bright. Okay, we're going to go down to the interface that hides everything. This is going to be, I always check the interface. I'm not really liking how there's nothing 
named, but that's for intuitive purposes. I'm sure you'll get the hang of it. Look at all the heroes, man. It's like, you know, you're already you're already spinning the wheel of fortune, guys. Let's, let's get them all. Let's see what we can win. You know, great idea. I love the flexibility of that. A lot of epic heroes. Um, not that many rare. It's only three rares. I was hoping maybe they might have four, maybe one for each resource. But it's not bad. You get uh, your main, you know, character that you pick the race and then it looks like you get two starting uh heroes that are gatherers of some sort not bad i like it a plus on the the gotcha the map the heroes so far guys it looks like it's going to be a good game so if you're still watching uh you know rest assured bear and the bear has got your back and he is giving it the okay to try the game now we're going to go to the packs. This could make and break depending on people's budget. If you're a free player, you've got nothing to worry about. If you're a low spender, this could be, you know, it could be the decision for you right here. So I want to speed through this. First purchase, okay, 99 cents. There's your, that's what they call an icebreaker, okay? These games, they're mechanics for the money monetization systems. There's always an icebreaker to get you in the door, so to speak. Because once you start to spend, you're going to spend some more. That's, a, that's the concept of it. Nothing bad. They all do this. Um, that's not bad. I got the intro. Let's play the intro. I didn't play that on the last one. So if you guys want to watch this, this might be something you might want to watch. Okay, she dances around. These are low graphics, though, so guys. Don't panic if you don't like the hair. I'm sure it's better looking, better device. Okay, you can see all the skills. That's great, great, great. Perfect. Okay, I love it. Worker support. If you want to get her 5111, you're going to have to spend, I think someone said seven. I'm not sure on that. Don't quote me. $5 for a permanent. I highly recommend if you're going to spend any money in this game. You got to buy this pack. I mean, right off the bat, uh, you could spend, I think, 5,000 gems to get that second builder, but you'd be better off saving your gems and just buying this if you're going to spend money. $5 for that, not bad. Okay, just the basic, you know, type of boost stuff. Okay, and bundles. Yep, I got all these here. Here's Tamaris. March. You got a lot of pretty good variety. You don't really need them, except for maybe the keys, maybe, but I'm not two through and about only three but daily deals i'm not really sure what this is to be honest guys i've um, been trying to look at some of this i'll have to examine it more but um okay frost scion you get scion okay yeah you get scion okay 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 yep okay so not too bad i do like the bundle thing three dollars three dollars a day Saves you half the price. That's a bargain, in my opinion. Okay, go to the basic monthly packs. They had two packs. They got a three dollar and five dollar. That's really cheap. Um, I thought the last game I was in was cheap, but this is even cheaper. Which uh, yeah, I'm a cheap stick skate, so I like cheap. So yeah, that's definitely a bonus, in my opinion. Okay, refreshes every day. You get the universal key. That's gonna be nice to get every day. Yeah. I definitely would recommend that. The construction pack, that's 10 bucks. So if you go with her, you're going to have to spend uh, probably $7, $17. Less than $20 for the first month. After that, you could spend, you know, on just $5 a month, which is a heck of a bargain. Or you could buy both of these, I imagine. These are season one. Daily Reward, Season 1. These are going to change with the next season, I'm thinking. I don't know about that. I'm just my first impression. Growth Fund. Here's another great advice. Uh, check this out. Uh, make sure you, there's no expiration. That's an A+. Plus. You can buy this anytime you want, guys. Uh, if you can wait a month and then get it, it's good advice. The Gems. Most games, the last one I had played, it was 50,000 gems. You could buy it the first time purchased, 100,000. But that's not, you know, depending on how, what, what the price is, the, the budget using your gems in this game. I'm not really sure. I'm not going to deduct any points for that. So that's not too bad. I recommend getting, if you're going to wait, I'd wait. I wouldn't buy the, just the 99 cent one and, and just, you know, 
puts away your first purchase. Uh, I'd, I'd say that if you want to buy gems, you could always save it and buy the 100 one. You get twice as many gems. So that might be an, an afterthought there. We're going to go up to the very top left to go to the AI. I'm going a little over my time. Um, more info. Okay, this is always good. It's going to, if I can click it. There we go. Yeah, it's got everything you need in there. I recommend always checking that out. Figure that out. Ranking. Have all your ranking. Okay, I got legions. Okay, I got that. Uh, settings. Okay, you got all the basic stuff there. I'm not going to go too much. I do want to go over general. They have some good settings. Hero training prompts. Okay, if you want, if you always get bugged out with like a red dot on a heroes and you don't want to level them, you can disable them. That's what I'm thinking here. So you can disable them all. I might just leave it that way. Okay, show dialogues. Get high purchase. Okay, not too bad. Not too bad. Not too bad. Confirmation war frenzy notifications. Another good bonus tip if you're still listening. If you want to get notified when you're getting scouted or attacked and you're at your work or you know you don't somewhere you don't want to have to have your phone on disable your phone uh, put it into uh, no notifications or what do they call that I'm trying to think what they call that uh, do not disturb options and hopefully this game has the option within your phone or whatever you're using to be able to enable this app to override that so what you could do if you're at work you could disable uh, do not disturb and activate that and then uh, and activate this is the only app that would work and if you hear anything on your phone you're going to know instantly you better check it if you, it, it could be, it's going to be the game so that's a great tip really i don't know never heard anyone ever tell you that tell tips like that before you know but you know i try to do what i can Okay, that's going to be about it. Let's go down here. I want to go. That's the hide interface. Okay, let's go to here. This is going to be, I'm going to try to just, this is the heroes. I already did that. Season adventures for the adventures. Okay, that's going to be interesting. Alliance. I love the look of this. I mean, it's just it's beautiful. I like the blue sky. It's vibrant and bright. That's the dragon trail. Perfect. Okay, nothing wrong there. I'd say if I had to give it a rating and keep it short, um, I want to say first impressions, I'd have to say it's probably an A or almost an A+, plus, but I don't want to give anything a perfect rating, but um, if this is good. I can tell you, I had, I already knew it was going to be good before I got on this. Like, I got another video I'm going to make here soon. I got so much stuff I want to make. But it's going to be basically, I'm going to explain why this is going to revolutionize city builders. Because I already know what it is. I spotted it like the first maybe four or five days I looked into research on this. And this, I discovered what they did. And uh, it's pretty amazing. And stay tuned for that video, you know. But anyway, I'm going to leave it at that. I hope, you know, you, someone might find this somewhat helpful if you haven't played yet. Uh, this is Bear and a Bear. And I'll talk to you guys later.